Aha, good evening, welcome to the unannounced stream. We have transcoding. How is the audio? Is the audio? Is the audio? Sounds okay. Which is fine. Right, okay. We are live. Welcome all to the stream. Um, camera's just going to have to do. There we go. Right. If you are hearing me, you're hearing me through my new amp preamp. Yay. Um, I need some credits. I need to buy some first aids and such. I don't have many. Savik, welcome to the stream. How the devil are you? Um, yes, here we are. We're live. And with the new mic preamp, which is a, a DBX286S, which is not a processor, which is what it sounds like. <laughs> no, it isn't. Um, Yeah, a bit of pocket change there. Right, okay, well, that's sorting itself out. Does it have a turbo mode? Yeah, 286S, yeah. Um, <clears throat> for those of you who don't know, it's, um, it's a mic pre, but it also has a compressor, noise gate, a little bit of EQ on it, etc. So, totally silent when I stopped speaking, which is pretty epic. Um, so it's got like a built-in noise gate, etc. What it means is I don't have to do all the, the stuff I used to do with um, plugins, etc. I can just do directly by connecting the microphone to the preamp and then to my interface instead of to my interface through a bunch of plugins and so on. It's kind of cool. I would like an elite assignment, so it apparently sounds okay. We've tested it on Discord. I've been messing around with it all day. I think I've got the settings pretty much where I would like them. So that's good. Whether it's going it, to... It probably won't affect um, Anarchy much. <laughs> but it does mean the CPU is doing a little bit less while I'm streaming. Um, because it doesn't have to. It doesn't have to do software um, compression. All, all I do with compression is make the quiet bits a bit louder and stop the loud bits from being much too loud so that when you actually listen back, the, the volume's fairly even. And from what I can hear in the headphones, it's it's doing exactly that. Without it, you would hear me going very low and very quiet, very low. And the other thing, and you turn your head just slightly off, it, it auto um, compensates for that. Very clever little system. Freelancers. Thank you all. Goodbye. Got two minutes on there. And we wait. We wait for the music and the email. Excuse me. Excuse me. Thank you. <laughs> right, there should be. Okay. There should be... Yes, there we are. Credit to Louis. Thank you very much. Goodbye. Weapons, general. Pharmacy. Advanced store. Superior pharmacy, I think. Right, we have... We have got uh, first aid... 15, 29 with general buff, etc. 
1453. Let me start two tens. Oh, oh, close, but no. Go to the advanced one instead. Sky Cannon, welcome to the stream. Downloaded a uh, went to log in and it says I'm not paid. I have given my card details. Um I'd log into your bank and just make sure it has taken the money. If it has, and it's still saying not paid, um, raise a ticket maybe. Probably what I'd do. You've done that, okay. Well, good, good. Hopefully they can get it uh, to work. And... 50 of those. Okay. Right. Yeah, Andy's usually pretty on the ball. Is he online at the moment? I don't actually know. Yes, he is. He is on Discord. If you've got... Um, if you've raised a ticket and had the email with the ticket number, if you mention it to him, quite often he can... Um, give you a, give it a gentle nudge in the right direction in other words give it a kick up the bum and get it working it's usually a good plan right okay uh, um, dailies I wonder if Tara is awake could be Go and get the daily anyway. Now, if he's on Discord and if you mention it to him the ticket number and then just leave it with him, quite often he can he can have a look at issues like that quite quickly um, and usually sort them out. He's done it. He did it for me once when I got double charged. Uh, he managed to sort it out for me. Camel one 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 one. Welcome to the stream. How the devil are you? You okay? I'm talking through my new mic preamp, which I'm really quite... I'm really liking it, you know. It sounds better than it did, really. A little tidier sounding. Um, also with a bit more sort of expansion at either end of the frequency range feels like it anyway it feels like there's more detail and what have you probably isn't probably just completely fooling myself but it does feel like it though i haven't social media because i wasn't planning on doing the streaming i probably should let's see if tara is up probably not but i thought i'd grab the mission in case she popped up whilst we were on stream. Go have a look, see. If not, well, we're going to Shadowlands anyway. Get ourselves a doja. Yeah, I'm good faff with it this morning. Watched, I don't know how. I mean, I've already seen, I don't know how many videos on it and. What have you? They've been around a while, they're nothing new. DBX286. Um, yeah, it's actually. <clears throat> Ask of the Knight in the first room. Really? Damn. I should have. The Aatrox Knight. I think I remember doing that. <clears throat> Was it a quest as well, or am I just misremembering now? It has been a while. Been a while since I've done much more than just randomly run in here.
men-at-arms. Oh. <coughs> um, you discuss me. We're trying to bring about positive change to the Warton world. True to my master's vision, we will be past this interruption in less than three hours. But it doesn't give you an exact time. Ah, okay. Um, social mediaizing. I think it's a different guy I was thinking of. Uh, I think that's uh, a different thing. Right, I should... Um, social media. Yeah. I mean, we're here now, so, you know. Et voila. There we go. And... We shall do one here. Wasn't planning on doing a stream at all today it's outside the days I would normally stream but um, yeah <laughs> got a new toy to play with etc so how is the audio as in my audio the audio of me <clears throat> Ends Lyric, welcome to the stream. The audio is fine, that's good. Yeah, it's just literally me going directly through the mic pre, straight into the computer, effectively. Right, so we've got about three hours. Let's let's try and get ourselves a doja. I may have started a bit late to be starting um, Naretvar as well. Now I'm going to have to start thinking about trimming this beard a bit. I keep finding it in my mouth. <laughs> Maybe we can do it tomorrow. I don't mind. We could get started tonight, but I'm just thinking for you know for you and 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 your time. You're up for it, okay? Let's see how quickly we can um, blast through a couple of dailies. I'm hoping I get a, new, a fast doja drop. <laughs> Started cooking in 20 minutes ish it's my wife's birthday oh well you have about an hour yeah i don't think we can get naret var done in an hour <laughs> is the honest truth that's what i was thinking normally you know like eight o'clock savik sidles away for her buble birth with michael buble singing in the corridor to sell Windows 10 updates, please. Oh, yeah, I know. I used to use, what was it called? Spybot Beacon. Used to block it for me. It just literally updates the... There's like a file in Windows with servers that are, bar are barred and it just adds, <laughs> it just adds Microsoft's um, update servers to it. And whenever they change the update server's uh, IP... It changes them as well. It was really good. It stopped it. It forced Windows to just not update for, I think, I think somewhere around 18 months. I didn't get a single update. <clears throat> it would try and check for them and just go, no updates available. And then just stop badgering me. 
I haven't had it installed for quite a while though. Um, so yeah, kind of annoying. Eight percent done working on updates. I hate them, and I hate that it's now trying to badger me to buy hardware to use Windows 11. It's like, no, screw you. I'm not going to touch it. Not with a barge bolt. Everything I've heard about it is terrible. And the Retvar gives the leg. It does. By the way, Naretvar gives, yes, <clears throat> is, is one of the best, re well, there's two reasons to do it. One, XP and research, and number two, yay, beta thigh. There's no way I'm touching Windows 11 with a barge pole. <coughs> the same way I, when I was on 7 and it was going, you should update to Windows 8. And I was like, nope, because Windows 7 is quite good, which means Windows 8 will be completely terrible. Same with XP. You should update to Windows Vista. I went into the Windows Vista beta. Um, and I can remember saying, right, we think we've got, we think this re release candidate's ready for market. And like the entire site was just one post after the other going, you are joking. This, this is a train wreck. And they released it. I remember in the, uh, was it the 2012 Olympics? Microsoft said, oh, we'll supply all the computers you need. Um, and they'll be coming with Windows Vista. And they said, can we have Windows XP, please? And they went, no, they'll be coming with Windows Vista. Um, <clears throat> and the Olympics committee turned them down and said, no, thank you. We'll use our old computers rather than new computers supplied by you with Windows Vista. They literally said, no. I think they just talked to the IT team and said, They're gonna, they've offered to do this. What do we think? And the IT IT team just went <laughs> they give him win that's not going to entice me to change my operating system I don't even use notepad I use notepad plus plus thank you very much yes dear Microsoft I would like more than one level of undo in a text editor thanks <laughs> Windows Notepad is awful. I haven't used... I think I use Windows Notepad, you know... Usually I only ever use it accidentally, rather than <laughs> deliberately. <laughs> I just find Windows, Windows Notepad is terrible. Yeah, Notepad++ is the way to go. M way better, especially if you're editing um, files and stuff. So, so much better. Vastly more powerful. <coughs> it is, it is brilliant, yeah. The, f the feature of dark mode in Notepad is not enough to make me upgrade. No, me neither. I was like, nice try, Microsoft, but no dice. Yay, Doja. Does everyone know what um, <clears throat> Notepad++ is? Do we know? Right, let me just find a text document then. Well, not even a text document. Let, let's look at... Um, oh, let's find something that you might want to edit with Notepad. This is um, like a game file or something like that. 
you know, like editing an ini file in a game. There you go. Um, Just looking through some files now for something useful to show you, but what what a massive dip! Well, you know, look, Anarchy Online folder. I just thought, well, very quickly, let me find it, and I'm not, then I can show you the difference. <laughs> oh dear, 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 dear. Uh, where have you gone? Hmm. Not normally live there. No. Do you know what? Don't worry about it. <laughs> oh yeah, for XML, yeah, ridiculously better. Enzleric redeemed hydrate for one hundred. Ah, <sighs> yes, that's better. Right, let's get this uh, doja handed in. I was trying to think of a good file to show you, but yeah, HTML file is very good. Um, do -do 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 -do. Why can I not see? Yeah, actually numbers every line in the document, etc. So when you're trying to um, edit stuff <laughs> it's so much easier to find where this that and the other is you know if you go if you like like if you had fallout 4 installed and you were like oh god i need to turn off mouse smoothing it's not a feature within the game but it is stored inside one of their um game any files and if you open that with notepad yeah you'll you'll probably find it without you know a ridiculous amount of trouble but you will find it a damn sight easier um, with uh, Notepad++. Like you could change four or five things and go, oh, the third thing was wrong, and go undo, 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 undo. Notepad, you can, you've got one level of undo. It's ridiculous. I've always thought that just made, meant it was more like a text viewer, a very basic text viewer, more than a <laughs> something working on anything. I found a doji chip in Inferno. There we go. Goodbye. Fantastic stuff. Right, okay, so we're going to go and take this nail. A quick prisoner do. You want to do Lord of the Void? Um, that's a good idea. 
Seeing as I was right in the office, I didn't even think of that. But yes, of course. Let off this. Lord of the Void. Bit of XP. Fairly easy, as long as I don't fall off. Or miss the jump like I did last time. I'm here for the elite assignment. Lord of the Void. Goodbye. We're going to go and do a quick Lord of the Void. Okay. Savik is bringing her dark. Is it? Game over. Job done. Um, yeah. I'm just going to head there now. <laughs> Finishing pumpkin. And on the way. Sounds good to me. <clears throat> there we go, we got a Savic. Yay, we has a Savic. Ends Leric coming on Eric. There we go. Sentient Viral Recorder. Hmm. I don't remember what the hell that was for. Nascent Wilds, I think we will. Right, okay. E I is here. I see a Savic somewhere. Well, I just did. Age a la sa vie. Here we go. Yeah, syntax colouring it does, yeah. But I, I like editing a lot of game files and things like that and a lot of games that I play. So, yeah, it's way, way better. Give me two seconds. The man with no name doing Lord of the Void, I see. Yeah, do you need Lord of the Void? Do you want the Lord of the Void daily? There's a corpse of Lord of the Void over here already. Right, let's try not to fall off this time. Oh, for f <laughs> I'll be right there. How do I screw that jump up? ever on any tune i just oh god man with no name yeah go lft and just put cal or something like that i know i know i've made that jump like a hundred times and yet i managed to fail it i think i just in lag or something like that maybe yeah, that's it. I'm going to blame the lag. It wasn't me. It was the lag. <laughs> it's the old, um, the old excuse, isn't it? Right. Don't think about it. Just do it. Yeah, you see, I didn't think about it that time and it was fine. Stray, jump and strafe at the same time while being turned a few degrees. Yeah, that, that'll 
Probably screw you up. Jump off. Yeah. Come to me, ugly. You know you want to fight me. Level 200 doctor. You can't get the daily. <laughs> Invite the others too, maybe. Yeah, I could do. There you go. Could be, uh... I mean, the dock is only level 200. You've got to be 215 to pull the mission, I think. I think it's 2.15, isn't it? Pew, pew. Absolutely pew, pew. Yep. Agility rings. <laughs> or just waiting to see Carl Follick. Shut up. You say it like, like I do it all the time. <laughs> oh, yes. Put the defensive HUD in, you fool. There we go. All the taunt. Miss the jump again, I bloody did. Like a good one. I don't know why. As soon as I thought, right, don't even think about it, just jump. You know, like sit, like just sitting in the car, you know, just getting in the car. I think, possibly, character in team, I think he's teamed with the dark and he's going to try and do this solo on the keeper, maybe. Yeah, I need to pull the um, the mission yet. So I've got to go and talk to Warden Stains, our friend. Yes. So I'm talking through a different mic pre. If I sound any different, that's why. Hopefully, I sound a lot better. I, as far as I can hear, I do. Um, I'm looking over because it's just sat on the desk at the minute. I need to find a more permanent solution for it, but I haven't really figured out where I'm going to put it yet. Because it is designed to go in a 19-inch rack, like most musical gear is. Um, so, yeah. Yeah, I think maybe he just wants to farm Lord of the Void, that's that's why he came over. He's just got it back up with a level 200 dock. And do the rest on his keeper. Could be. Bit of, bit of a quick dual log. I would say if I had my keeper and dock and I could play both at the same time. I can't, they're on the same account, but if I could, I could easily do this. Once he got UBT on it and everything else. Can't overwrite the... Well, I've got the 8-hour running, but it's only running for 15 minutes, I think. Yeah, go on. Beam. Silver Spider Knuckles. You can have them. Thank you very big. Geronimo! I deliberately jumped off this time. <laughs> Right, I need to talk to Warden Stains. Yes, indeed. So it's uh, if you want to if you want to Google it, it's DBX two eight six S is the new uh, mic pre that I'm talking to. But it's much more than that. You probably heard a thing. Well, maybe you haven't. There's um, <clears throat> when you've got dynamic mics like like this one, they tend to need quite a lot of um, gain 
So generally, um, most mic preamps in interfaces you buy for computers, you know, except until you get to this, like super pro level stuff, uh, usually only have about 55 dB again. And you need that like full all the way over just to get that much. Um, but when you do that, you're running the, the thing at absolutely the max. Um, <clears throat> it doesn't always sound its best. So um, this has, I think, 60. So you're not quite at full, but, you, you know, you're within its tolerance. But then not only that, um, what people will do is buy a thing called a cloud lifter, um, which just adds an extra 20 to the you know the the gain at the front and makes it much louder what do we got there stuldut stuldad 98 has followed thank you very much for the follow um yeah so if you add the 20 db gain that's it that's all it does whereas this um <clears throat> adds more um, and then gives you a compressor, a very nice hardware compressor, by the way, a de if you need it, and a bit of e um, and like an enhancer for EQ, so you can sort of pinch out some of the boominess and stuff, but keep a lot of the bass. And then it's got a um, an actual enhancer, which is what I use as a noise gate, effectively. So when I when I stop talking, there's like zero signal, and any any background noise is greatly reduced once it falls below a certain level. We're going older, old Athen grid. So <laughs> it was all working fine. I was looking forward to using it tomorrow, because what what happens if you use VSTs and plugins on your um, OBS. They're, they're all good, but they are using CPU time. And the other thing, of course, is you then join someone else's um, channel, let's say, and you lose all that. So suddenly you're, you're, you're back to just the mic all on its lonesome. Did someone say they had a fixer ready here? I can grab mine if not. Now, the thing that always um, <clears throat> stopped me from ever buying one of these was, well, you know, they were bloody expensive. Um, but then... Okay, I'm going to log my fixer then. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> we got loads of fixer grids. Right, I have diseased... Milky Way left. So you, you're getting a ton of extra hardware on top and a lot more control. Um, and I got it for silly money. I'm pretty sure it was... Um, I think the original price is like 300-odd UK pounds. And then it turned up on... From, a, from an actual music store, like a proper retailer has a proper shop and all that and been in business for years it suddenly turned up on their site as one there for like i was like oh there's one there. one just turns up really cheap and you're like okay wasn't expecting that but uh, i think we're, we're a little little early i know we're about right There's a gam keep here. We'll, we'll grab the gamel. And fist that already in team. Okay, we'll join your team. spawn in a couple of minutes yeah so you get a ton of ton of whatever for um not much more money but yeah it turned up about a third the normal price it was like wait what 
and it said nearly new. And the only thing wrong with it is someone's, I don't know, bought it or opened the box and it's just scratched the outer box. The actual unit's in perfect condition. There's a, maybe a slight little bit of a ding, maybe where it's been bolted into a rack, but that's about it. <clears throat> you downloaded AO off Steam. Yeah, but you, you, you've still got to do all the payment on Funcom's site. You can't make the... The only thing you can do payments on is, you know, for like the... Um, luxurious armor, things like that. The rest of it, you've got to. Yeah, you know, everything else, like a regular sub and all that, still goes through Funcom site. So, yeah. <laughs> yeah it doesn't link if you put your bank card details into steam that just allow, allows you to buy things on steam that's about it My god, the prisoner is turning a bit green. I feel a bit sorry for this prisoner. <laughs> I seriously do. It's like, oh my god. <laughs> Yeah, it would be nice if you could buy AO game time via Steam, yeah. But the way they their front end for payments is, is organised, it would probably be a lot easier. But also, I don't know. It'd be too simple for them to do that. So, of course, they don't. <laughs> but then you couldn't know Jandy when it doesn't work. Okay, that's that one done. And we got... We got... Beaconage? Poor prisoner. <laughs> right, I, I'm going to beacon. Just for the speed, because the next one is rats. So i got to go that one alone. Damn you, rats. <laughs> I don't know, actually, can you share rats daily? Not sure. Never tried. Never actually tried, so anyway. It's gonna look like I am the kill master to anyone in team. They'll see me and go, oh my god, look at all these mobs! <laughs> He's killing all the mobs. Get this done, hand them in, maybe get started on some of the areas of uh, Noretva. That would be pretty cool. Come on, horrible roller rats. I always like to pick up a few en route on my way <laughs> to the NPC. I've been traumatized by red roller rats in old mission while opening closed doors on <laughs> red missions. I think we all have at some point. I only have 15 minutes. How many did I just pull from over there? 
Yeah, whatever. Only showed three kills in that all team members can loot these remains, but it was definitely more than two or three. I like my beach of fun over here. There's a lot on this beach and quite a good density, so... Well, after I found some over here, I was kind of like, I've got to come over here for them. <clears throat> Otherwise, I'm taking too long to do the mission. All right, start here. Come on. It's supposed to be the scourge of the game, you things. Get all slacking off. <laughs> Just not even trying. Come on. Wait, 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 wait. Come on. Come on. Watching them on the mini map skirting off like that. <clears throat> very, very naughty. Messing me around. Yes, I'll be having none of that. Thank you very much. <laughs> yeah, ordinarily you're just pulling on mob aggro, proximity aggro, aren't you? Oh, excuse me. How many have I killed so far? 87, okay, just need it. Less than 20 more. <laughs> Mongo, yeah, you'd think, wouldn't you? There's like an ideal run speed in here, but I don't know what it is. I've definitely got more than... What did I need? 13 following me. <laughs> yeah, you can run past some of them, it's just bloody ignore you. I think there is an upper limit to how many mobs will actually follow you. Oh, I was going to sneeze then. Right. I killed 100 roller bats. Goodbye. Right, I'm going to go hand in and then... Time for getting a start on Neret Bar Canyons. I might even be able to do the first one solo, not sure been a few months since we've been in there so <laughs> making disgusting noises was <laughs> yeah wow <laughs> the music and such Men's lyric. So, cooking time. Be right back. Okay, dude. Enjoy lay cooking. Oh, I need to talk to Warden Staines again. So, we've done Doja. That's already handed in. So, then we'll hand in Lord of the Void is automatic XP. And completion. No having to return for that one. And then just hand in the other two. Should be good, I think. Yeah, I wasn't expecting too many people on for tonight because I don't actually normally stream on a Thursday. I usually give myself a night off. But, you know, kind of felt, felt okay for tonight to maybe do that. Thought maybe it'll be fun. 
another dead prisoner. A lot of green, whatever, dude. Goodbye. So for those on the stream, how is my microphone audio? Is it good? Bad? Indifferent? Can't tell any difference? If you can't tell any difference, that's actually good. Um, <clears throat> it means I haven't broken anything. <laughs> If you can hear, there's more low end, or it's clearer, or there's more detail. That's even better. It means you invested in some quality headphones. Goodbye. More XP. Can I have my reward now? Goodbye. Oh, finished another research line. Brutality 9. And now on Brutality 10. Which is more one hand blood. <laughs> just where the loop ends maybe more detail sounds like you have more depth to your voice yeah I think so um, it's just a better preamp basically it can pick up more detail coming from the microphone I'm not you know obviously I can't suddenly have more depth and it's not um, <clears throat> I can't you hear people and they boost the bass on on their voice and you can it stands out a mile I don't know why they think um, the you know please no don't 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 do that everyone can tell <laughs> you know, it's like if you don't have a chest voice um don't don't try and make one with EQ because it just you no know, doesn't work um it, just, it doesn't sound right um i mean you can you can maybe do the proximity effect you know um but it can only pick up what's there it just picks up the very low frequencies that normally dissipate <laughs> when you're not right on top of a microphone but yeah apart from that you know and it, invariably when you do it it sounds very muddy and hard to uh hard to listen to so yeah the um it does have like a, it's got like a bass treble thing so i've just got them just slightly engaged like it goes from like uh, off to 20 and <laughs> i've got it set on two on low end and two on uh, high end that's it um all it does is just push out how much further it can it will listen to things it depends, you see, you wouldn't do that on, say, an electric guitar if you were running a mic in front of a cabinet to hear. So, yeah. Uh, so the freelancers did, 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 nearly halfway to 220. Right, Retvar, do we think we can get one or two started, Sav? What do you think? One of the main reasons for this is I no longer have to rely on VSTs remembering their settings. This is a piece of hardware with knobs on it, and each knob's like, it's one of those indented knobs, so as you turn in, it's going just ever so, you know, it's quite nice to use, in fact. Um, so, yeah. The only other thing I'm thinking is that even if I can solo maybe the first one or two, I'm going, going to struggle, I think, um, just on how long it'll take. Let's do it tomorrow, maybe. Have to go in like 15 minutes. Oh, God. When is the next, uh, when's the next guy? Event call-outs. Today at... 2.38 p.m. Reaper will spawn in nine hours, which is about three hours from now. I am into Naretvar Canyons. <laughs> yeah, we can get it done usually in a couple of hours on stream. Um, so, yeah. We'll try maybe one. The first one's not too hard, I don't think. 
It's just uh, the, the main thing is I get lost in the Retvar canyons, especially in the bigger missions where you've got to go to like three or four locations. I I just get so so lost doing that that oh it's oh, oh. but Savik is amazing in that it, she's basically memorized the entire layout of the place. So when she's there, it's it's kind of like right come this way go that way come the other way <laughs> you know it's like pretty amazing stuff really the gauss or the geese i was told you could use some help what do you mean i need space in my inventory more than i've got at the moment i have too much crap in here uh, I can't be dropped. Oh god! Um, you has too much stuff. Um, ah, here we go. You can go there. It's a Dutch name. <clears throat> EU is like ooh in German. What's the O with the two little ears over the top? How is that pronounced? I'm going to have to Google this now, aren't I? Samick knows, because Samick knows bloody everything. Hang on. How to pronounce... How to say ooh. No, don't, no! Go away, Apple. How dare you even try and advertise at me. Oh, it's a YouTube video. <sighs> Just... Uh... Translate. Right, there we go. Detect language. Oh. Oh. I think so. You said German. Um... You find the German. Ooh. 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 English? Oh. <laughs> you can't spell it any other way. English doesn't have this sound. Makes sense, yeah. Never mind. Bombing run. What's with the aerial all the fences? This has a play option. Oh, let's have a look. Let's have a look. Hush. Oh. Hush. Hush. Is that how you pronounce just that then? Oh, that's her name. Right, so she's Corporal de Hush de Hush. Okay, <laughs> I have no idea, and we wonder why we can't pronounce Savik's characters' names in game. Now you know. Mind you, no one can pronounce mine either, so you know, I don't know what I'm talking about. Calm, Eddie G. Oh my god, it's Calmedig. Messic. Messic. <laughs> it's what you grow up with. Digging machine. Okay. Yeah, okay. Have I got. I do. I can't spell your fix's name. What? Llewellyn? Do you mean Llewellyn? Actually, let's switch map here. Select map. Um, oh. Next time it's been where's bit next map? I think that's it.
Where the hell am I going in Area A then? We've got... Try say that. There you go, I just did. Failed miserably, no doubt. <clears throat> oh yes, while I'm here, select yourself. Press that. <clears throat> I don't think it landed right. There we go, little baby reflect. Operator. I can't remember what you do in this one. It's the other thing, Savik actually knows what she's doing in here. I, I always kinda go, what am I, what we're we doing in here? <laughs> And then, then just get it complete and utterly wrong. Right, I am here. Exit start. Area A. What what do I do in here? Digging machine. One's called all has told you the tunneling machine in the different age thing within the magic area. Your option is to make your way into area. Use the unicorn hacking tool to disrupt the machine. Right, I'm looking for a machine. Is it marked on his map? I'm not seeing it. Zoom in. Okay, that's quite a long way away. I have to stand next to these things, don't I? All the way east. Thank you, Savik. I think I can manage manage one light, but that's about it. Oh, great! Another engineer as well. So he's debuffed my nano as well. My cocoon. One second, one mile per, per whatever. Yep, debuffed by the engineer. You better drop some green stuff for the, um, for Vortex or I won't be happy. German Microwave, welcome to the stream. No, he didn't. Okay. Is his debuff gone? That's their debuff, isn't it? That's not so bad. Down, 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 down. These don't drop anything, do they? Nope. Really, the snare doesn't go away. Who's that? Oh. oh, technician. Okay. Like the APF snare, but not as long. Yeah, you're not kidding. It's. I think it's more severe as well. Don't you nuke me, you horrible little man. I will squish you. Also, there we go, a bit of light. Well, that made no difference. Okay. In which case, let's brighten the stream slightly. There we go. Yay, blue thing. A bag with nothing in it yet. Yeah, you'll do. <laughs> My God, getting hammered in here. Usually I've got reflect and whatnot while we're in here. Like proper reflect, not, not my made up 
Toy Town reflect there. I seem to remember running down here for this. Avoiding as many mobs as possible. <laughs> and then clicking on a machine. Something like that. This feels a little better now. <clears throat> he said. <laughs> I'm missing. No, I'm not missing any buffs. Right, where are we? Don't we go over this bridge or something? Gotta get all the way over there. I think I've got a cross, haven't I? That's the dirty great big hole in the ground. Figure out where the hell I'm going first. Okay, there's those spots. It's okay. He does have a, a limit to how far he'll run. I thought so. But you can't blitz past the gate turrets because they will just. Um, snare you and you're no longer running from anything <clears throat> right, here you go you're doing less than walking speed which is not good decided doing this on melee was a good idea. I don't know. And good evening and welcome to the stream, German Microwave. Good to see you. I'm concentrating and trying not to die. This felt a lot easier on Keeper. <laughs> Slow mo, what's my run speed with this on? It'll be something horrible. Oh, minus 974. Yeah, you're going nowhere. <laughs> It's like, yeah, nah. And sitting down doesn't get rid of it either. Are you off to bed, Sav? Okie doke. I'm going to be beaconing out because I can't find my way out, aren't I? <laughs> All right, where's this machine? <coughs> okay, let's start with... <coughs> sensibly attempting to pull these dudes over let's let's go come on you shall die engineer I hate these ones. So, <clears throat> Savik will sidle off. 
get herself her buble bath <laughs> when Michael Buble turns up to Savick's house runs a large bubble bath with rubber ducks glass of red wine a little dark chocolate and then stands in the hallway blindfolded um, singing cool jazz while Savick has a soak <laughs> no not really Felt, I felt I might have to explain, not really. Right, engineer. Where the chuff are you going? Where did he come from? Yeah, oh. He has a pet in here. Whose pet is that? Is that someone I know? <clears throat> if you want to pull as many mobs as possible use a pet <laughs> I don't know why but it just does is that yours is it the man with no name have you done this one already fight me yeah whenever I would play on my pet classes it's always the pets that cause issues with aggro see see you'll stood over there Spare mobs coming in. <laughs> no, let me, let me, hang back. I'm going to find this silly machine now. Now I've got an extra one that I didn't want for free. And this is the worst way to fight these in a group. There's a blue do hickey if you need um, a blue for vortex. Might be more than one. One there. On. Do you need one? You know, the little blue thing like that. Yeah, it's on one of those down there. There you go, you got it. Cobalt Blue Notum Crystal. Yeah, I don't know if it's to do with the eye line, the height the pets are at, or something, but every time I bring pets anywhere near this place, or most places. Okay, I found the control. What do you want me to do? Ah, yes. It opens like a dialogue box. And if we've been quick enough, we can just run out. Have you ever done? Have you done this this mission? If you've not done it, yeah. Right-click the digging machine as though it's um, a dialogue thing. You know, like when you do the towers in the DB quest. <clears throat> Or did I mention things respawn like buggery in here? That's why if you come in with a team, it's a lot better because you, you're quick enough that nothing's respawning <laughs> and blocking your way out. Okay, run out. <laughs> Hope that the, uh, the way is clear, but it probably won't be. Oh, did you check in? No. Run, 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 run. <laughs> Don't stop for anything. Oh, crap. Have you got snared? Uh. 
There you go. Just run this way, this way, this way, this way. Come on, I pulled them on myself to save you. Like a good enforcer should. Now I'm trying to find my way out. Where's the... Here we go. Okay, you made it through without the snare. Good job. <laughs> Doing the rectvar completely wrong. Yay. Okay, let's talk to her. Lance Corporal. Digging machine has been taken care of. Give you thing of me. You give me XP, thank you. Also found this key card. Show the fragment. Oh no, you don't actually have to trade it to them, do you? Okay. Now what? Uh, area B. Can't remember what Area B is like. Okay, Area B. What do we do in Area B? Let's have a look. Area B, the fortification. Dust Brigade depot located within Area B. According to the Lance Corporal, the area is heavily secured with a series of shield generating towers, which may require a bit of effort to remove. Once you've removed, uh, penetrated the base, ask that you terminate the power supply master with it. Ah, uh, yeah, we might struggle with that one. The, the, I think B you need a dock for, I think. Uh, let's have a look. Let's uh, let's let's do a little Google, or you know, basically just look up the quest on AOU. Um, uh, Legacy of the Zan, is it? No, uh, Lost Eden is it under there. No, where have you put it? And this is the one with the towers. I think so. Yeah. No, it's not. Where, where's your bloody guide? Counter guides. Archie Bortax, the Zan, Dark Pyramid below. No, no, it's not that. It's not that. Where's the rep? You know what? <laughs> the rep var. Canyons. Oh, Canyon Anarchy Online. Yeah, there you go. AOU does have a guide for it, but I just couldn't remember it. Okay. Digging machine we've done. Fortification B. Oh, yeah, you need a team for this, really. Because <clears throat> you've got to simultaneously take out three generators and then take down the boss. And the thing inside the room. And then disruption. You've got a lot of running around. Uh, area E has... Oh, God, that's a nightmare that can be. We had, like, three or four goes at that. And then X, end of the world. Um, yeah, I would I would say a dock for, for B. When you can get in there and you're okay, but then you've got to deal with trying to take down three different things it's like a miniature sector 42 kind of a mechanic you know isn't it quicker just a d12 man quicker doesn't have any xp though have you talked to her since we got back more or less a daily's worth of xp for handing and for completing that so yeah yeah we're not going to do it with just two people anyway <laughs> and this isn't a regular stream this was just me more or less just I want to try out my new um, DBX voice pre or mic pre more accurately just to make sure it's all working nicely on the stream and it definitely seems to be so yeah I'll come and do this uh, tomorrow 
I guess. It would make more sense to do that. Sounds like it's working nice. Good. That's what we like to hear. It should sound better than the VST plugins because it's hardware that is reacting in real time, just like in any studio or on a stage or what have you, versus VSTs, which always have a bit of latency, so the compressor doesn't quite catch everything. So sometimes you, you peak a little too loud or um, something you say gets stuck. Plus the preamp that's actually in it makes no sound a full gain. You can, I can whisper into the mic at full gain and you can't hear anything in the room. It's amazing. There's just no hiss on the channel whatsoever. Really, I mean, for the price I paid for it, it's bloody amazing. Works just fine. Savik had better time tomorrow. And then you have a guide. Yeah, we'll do this tomorrow. Tomorrow is going to be Naretvar Day, I think. Right. Well, thank you everyone for coming along. <laughs> Shortest stream ever. It's not really a proper stream. It's kind of um, me trying out my audio hardware, really, is mostly what I'm doing here. Um, <clears throat> who else is in here? Louv Lufaren TV is, is streaming somewhere quite low. Talk to them. Okay, he's streaming there. Do we want to go to Lufaren? He's leveling a 220 enforcer. We go raid him. You think we go raid them? Could be cool. Okay. Soto Mahoney, always fun watching you, says the evil ominous spy. Yes, indeed. Okay, we'll go raid him. Uh, he's leveling a, a 220 enforcer, I think. All aboard. Go raid another AO streamer. Yes, indeed. Right. I will be back tomorrow for a proper stream. I think um, we've decided that the uh, DBX 286S uh, is fantastic. Basically has turbo mode. Right, thank you all. I'll see you proper tomorrow for a real stream. So until then, bye for now.